I'm gonna show you how to blend captions, pop-ups, motion graphics, and sound effects into a cohesive theme so that you can create your own signature style that you can turn into a recognizable brand for yourself or your clients. In other words, I'm gonna hold your hand and give you a dummy-proof tutorial on how to edit like these guys. All right, so instead of diving in head first, I'm gonna take you through a little editing bootcamp. We're gonna go over how to highlight words as your subject talks. We're gonna go over this number counter text effect. We're gonna go over how to put anything behind you and make it look good. And to wrap it up, I'm gonna show you the main sound effects I use in videos like this. So we're gonna be creating something that looks like this. So you're gonna to wanna to go to effects, titles, and then drop in a text plus clip. Then type in whatever you want it to say change the font to Rubik, then go to shading, click this number two, enabled, and drag up the thickness. Then change your color to black. Next, go to effects, go to open effects, and drag in a drop shadow. Turn the drop distance down to zero, shadow strength to one, and blur down a little bit. Then go to your fusion tab and search for the glow, add that in, and drag it down a little bit. This part's important, right click on the text box, and select character level styling. Next, cut your text plus clip to however long they say the words. This is gonna determine how long the highlight effect stays on your word. So after you've done that, go to the Fusion tab, click Template, Modifiers, then select the word and change the color to whatever you want. Red is the most visible. Once you've done that, for all of them, it should look like this. So now if you want them to increase in size as well, you can go back to the Fusion tab and increase the size a bit, and you'll get something that looks like this. So let's look at how to create this effect. Go to Effects, Titles, and drag on a Text Plus clip. Right click the text box and select Expression. You'll see this little window come up, and what you're gonna to wanna to do is copy paste this. I'll put it down in the description, but you just copy paste that into this little box here. Your screen should look like this. So now we can edit this. So go to this little zero, and that's where your number's gonna start. So I'm gonna put a thousand. And then over here is where your number's going to end. So I'm gonna put 3000. Now using your arrow keys, go over to where it says pre, and whatever you put in between these quotations is what's going to appear in front of the number. So I'm going to put a money sign and then go over to where it says post and whatever you put in these quotations is going to appear after the number. So I'm going to put nothing. So once you click away, it should look like this. However long your text clip is, is how long it will take to reach the numbers. So now you can customize this how you would customize any text clip and you're done. All right, we're gonna begin by holding Option and clicking and dragging our clip up, which will duplicate it. We're gonna take that to the Fusion tab and search for a magic mask and add that in. Then draw over your subject and select Better. Then select Track Forward and let the magic do its thing. Next, you're gonna take any clip and drag it in between the two. And you can take this and select Composite Mode and select Screen. Now I'm gonna add a glow to that and that's pretty much it. So with what I just gave you combined with my video on captions and my video on how I build and animate characters, you can edit whatever you want. 